What? Yeah, I'll check it once. Okay, let's see how it's going. Uh, 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 uh. So, my like, let me know once you are uh, checking. Uh, yellow? You there? Um, hello. Okay, you are there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yay! So, you can hear my voice through the, through the stream? Hmm, yeah, I can. I mean, if it's just working fine, let me just check out YouTube. Okay, okay. So my voice, everything is fine, right? Like mm. it is in audible range and stuff. I mean, I got it amped up to six hundred, so it will basically be audible to me. Amped up to six hundred percent? How? Um, the extension thingy. Ah. Oh wait, I don't think it actually applies to all tabs. So never mind. Huh. So my voice is fine then. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. Um, YouTube. Well, time to do another dungeon, Copper Bell Mines. Yeah, YouTube is working fine too. Woohoo! Yay! Yeah. Yeah, uh, she's close. Double the screen. Yep. Yeah. So yeah, description for Copper Bell Mines. You have been granted permission to enter the mines. Make a way through the tunnels, putting down any Yeah you encounter. Or do I call That's what something. do we name them? Hectagon? Or something like that. Uh, uh Hecaton. What are those Hectagon? Gears. Yeah, I'm Hecaton just gonna call gears. them Hecton Gears. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah. Or just Hackers. Yeah. Entrance, enter Copper Bell hack. Mines with NPCs. Wait, I, can you go back to that on that bottom left screen? I then forgot to read it. Uh, this one? Y yeah, I've been granted permission to enter Mines. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. Make your way through the tunnels. I thought it was some dialogue for some reason. Ah, I mean, that's the summary oh. of this dungeon. Yeah, yeah, gosh. Yeah. Entrance. So with NPCs. Come in. You keep my show. Wait, is Sanalan the older thing or is it? Sanalan is older. Okay. Oh, eager marauder, eager conjurer, this... and eager tomatoch. Ah. Yep, they are really. It's the marauder, eager. right? That. That. Guy. Oh no, he's. I think it's the same guy. He's gonna do the same thing now. <laughs> okay. I hate this guy. Okay. Oh no, yep. He started doing it again. It's like PTSD for me at this point. <coughs> la 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 la. Yep. He's my nightmare, man. It's my fucking nightmare. I've uh, seen the blast doors. Door is locked tighter. Oh, tiny key. 
It's a hard. You do all the chef first. I'm wrong. Like you must have heard of them before, right? Ah, uh, be I did it with other players. Like there was no option. Before there is no option to play with NPCs. Like that was the that was the latest edition. You know hmm. because of the DPS used to have really really long queues. Okay. To play with other players. So okay. yeah, in order to combat that, they introduce NPCs. But they, but they had to introduce us to this guy, huh? They had to do that for some yeah. fucking reason. <clears throat> what? This guy. What do you call that? From trade off or something? Yeah, yeah, maybe. Yep. I'm just gonna leave that bitch here. That's it. <laughs> Don't need him, huh? Yep. I'm just gonna solo this, I guess. Yep, Easy. they are here. Oh damn! <laughs> <laughs> that was smart. Uh, la la. Yep, he's at it again. No, 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 don't come after me. Go after the tank. It, it kind of reminds me of that one thing they put some sort of alarm or something in gyms. Wait. You know, anyone who does shit like this during the workout, if someone makes sounds like this, it just goes off. Wait, uh, CrossFit? Um, I not th gyms in general. Huh. I think I'm that's... not sure if it's in India, but it, it's then other outside countries. I don't think it's an Indian thing. Like, if it's an Indian thing, people will be absolutely pissed. <laughs> and you know how Indians be like. Yeah. <laughs> ah, that's something, dude. It's, it's called some bell. Huh. Uh, these are it. the hectagon dudes. I'm just gonna call them hectagons, I... that's it. Huh. Oh, you're still alive. Um Is Hectagon a word? Hectagon eh? Is it a word? Is it actually a shape? Yeah, it is. How many sides? Uh, hectagon... Seven, I guess? Seven is septagon. What, hectagon is a thing, right? I, I'm not so sure. Huh. Uh, maybe I'm misremembering things. Maybe. I think you're just mixing things up. Yeah, maybe. Six is hexagon, seven septa, eight octa. Oh yeah, then oh, I'm mixing things. I forgot what nine is. Nanogon? <laughs> Probably not. Yare yare. Ten is probably Decagon or something. Nine. Ten Wait, is... I was supposed to look up something else. I mean, what's the point though? No, 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 no. I told you I was going to look up something else. Ah, the bell. Yeah. Ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, I'm just going to call them hectagons. That's it. Sure. I mean. <gasps> yeah, it's called Lankalam. What? Okay, okay. That's what they're called. Yeah. And Lunk is, Lunk is a derogatory word, I think it means something like stupid. Huh. Yari yari. <laughs> they had to do that, huh? Yep, they went hard on that name. Yari yari. Mm. I mean, I'm not completely opposed to that idea, though. Yeah, some people grunt too much. Yep. 
But I think those alarm alarms have zero tolerance. Like yeah, even if you make slightest true. of the noises, you know they go off. Yeah, I saw a video once. I think a guy dropped a pen or something. Yeah, <laughs> that and that's not a good thing. Like yeah. sometimes when you are really tired, you might you know release a grunt or two. Yeah, that it could be involuntary sometimes. Yeah. I mean you can't do anything about that right Yeah Fire sand, fire sand. Mm, powder chamber up is to hold tall and fire slide So what if I do this you want with the fire sand in the powder chamber Okay I think I need to find additional fire sand Huh. Yeah. Okay, I have six sounds. Yes, I need another fire sand. Maybe I missed it somewhere. I have no clue what fire sands are. Yeah, that's what you use to blast that thing. Like. That's the fuel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I got I got that from the context, but I don't know where you found some the six of them. Yeah, me neither. Like I have six on six on pinches of fire sand one, so two will make it twelve, right? So I need another set of fire sand, I guess. But yeah, I don't I know don't where even to. See that. Okay, fine, whatever. I mean, um, there's a prompt here. Like uh, the powder chamber appears to hold twelve ounces of fire sand. And right now I have six ounces of it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. The left. Not. Yeah. Wait, wait. Am I supposed to find it though? Let me... Where do you see this? You got six again. Ah, uh, here. Ah, yeah. uh, six ounces, pinches of fire sand, one. So if I have two of them, it then it will make twelve ounces, right? Something like that. I mean. Huh. Uh, okay. It says right. you obtain a six on spinch. It, it it doesn't say you have them. You obtained them. Yeah, obtain one. Now I have to obtain another one, right? Yeah, but where does it say you obtained one? It says you obtain. Like it's saying a statement in general. It doesn't. Yeah, say but I did pick up uh, some fire sand, right? So I'm assuming I oh, picked you up. Did? I... Okay, I I don't know. I don't see. Huh? Now where am I supposed to find that other fire sand thingy? I have no clue. I have no clue. I'm positively lost. Okay, this it's not here. Okay, it's okay. up there. Uh, Fuck me. It's a sneaky fire sound. Yep. Real sneaky. Uh, yep. Yes. Uh, can you turn on your noise suppression or something? Because I'm hearing oh. my voice. Okay. Activating blasting device. Blast it. <laughs> Oof! Oh no! What the fuck is that? Uh, you are speaking, right? Or not? Wait, 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 wait! wait. I this went on mute and deaf for a second. Huh? I suppose you asked me something, but I missed. Huh? I mean, I was wondering whether you could able to hear me or not. What the fuck was that? Hey, no. Yeah, is it any better? Like, what can the... you hear yourself now? Yeah, I can. I can't hear you. Like, my you, you I can't can hear me. myself. Yeah. Okay. Catapult. 
What? Oh no, no. I just got a thing called catapult. Catapult? Yeah. Lumbering oh, no. leaf. Ah, okay, those are his attacks. Yep, this guy is pissed. Yep, that means he looks best. I mean, early dungeons, these used to be shit, like with weird ass mechanics. They used to be like some gimmicks. And if you fail that gimmick, it used to wipe everything. So in order to make it accommodating for new new people, they changed a lot of mechanics. To be in line with the whole game. Like these are some basic encounters, now you will encounter the whole game, like these mechanics. Yeah. Uh, obtain the treasure key. Seal the blasting. Uh, okay, noise suppression is suppressing your voice now. Yari yari. Yep. I mean, I was doing that really low pitched Maggie sound, so. Maggie sound? Not Maggie. Mickey. Is it Mickey? That guy from South Park. Ah. Yeah, he is Matthew. Oh no, a wild Lucy appeared. Yay, catch Yay. him. Yay. Gotta catch him all. Uh, I have no fire sand on me, so... Do you have a Pokeball on you? Nope, not that either. Damn it. Damn it. Oh no, oh. he's gonna grunt again. Oh. Why is he like this, man? Just fucking die, mate. Oh. Is yep. it move? Yup. Oh no, Doozy is like yari yari. Yari yari indeed, my friend. So the tables have turned. I mean, if well, you consider well, them well, as stables. Um, Maybe he's just campaigning for Ahmad Me Party. Maybe. Okay. He just keep saying off a lot. Yeah, the this guy had enough of him. He just self-destructed himself. He's like, I'm done, man. I'm beat. I can't take these grunts anymore. And he's like, self-destruct. Goodbye, Chrome. Yeah. <laughs> he couldn't able to deal with that anymore. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Powder chamber. Fire sand. And blasting device. <laughs> Blast. GG. Easy. Yay. Yeah, Fire no. sand. Oh no. Big ass jelly. No, um, you see that's Dr. Jerida. Okay, yeah. Uh, this particular boss used to have one of the more uh, annoying mechanics in the game. Like one of the bullshittiest mechanics for new players. So they get rid of that completely and had new boss mechanics for him. They redesigned him completely recently. What did he use to do earlier? Uh, you can't. You can't just, like, this guy doesn't take any damage at all. 
Yeah. yeah. Like how it works is, uh, you have to collect fire sand, and we have to take this boss to a designated area and blast him out. Out. Once you blast him out, he will multiply into uh, smaller slimes. Then you have to repeat the process again till he disappears. Yeah, if the tank doesn't know what he is doing, then he will not take this guy to the designated area, right? Yeah, then the whole party is fucked. Yeah, if if he if that guy is new to tanking and he doesn't know what he is doing, then everyone are fucked. That's it. So that's why they took out those mechanics. Because mm. if this is end game, most people will know how to play tanks. But this is early game, right? Yeah. I you never know. Some people get just do that, you know, just to spite the rest of the squad. Maybe. In the end, it's a bad mechanic. Even if someone wants to grief you, then there's nothing you can do about it. Yeah. Die slime. Pa pa ra pa 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 ra. Treasure coffer. Powder chamber. Brass thing good device. La la. So they just call them living fossil. That's it, huh? What the fuck? Did he just went into that pit just to spy? Yeah, yeah. Oh no! Oh no! I accidentally pulled more mobs now. That's oops. Man. I can't wait to get more abilities. Like playing with only three or four abilities sucks. Yep. Uh, so we are just gonna beat the shit out of living fossil, I guess. Sure. Yeah. Why not? Uh, screw paleontologist, stay. Eh? The other one should deal with fossils, right? Yeah. <coughs> no, is it archaeologist or something? I don't know. Uh, archaeologist, man? Mm, I guess such people dig up shit, right? Yeah. I mean, they dig up fossils and stuff, so. Okay, it all today is for study of fossils. Not the That's hmm. Treasure coffer. Yay. Coffee. Uh, well, where am I supposed to go again? Okay. Mops are this way, so. That's a bit hippo, surf. It doesn't look like a hippo. That's a gibbet. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm just gonna beat the shi- Ouch. Stonebreaker? Is it not the ones that we faced before? Yeah, uh... We are suppo- I mean, we came into this dungeon to kill his kind, so... We are just exterminating them. 
I mean, these are the ones that had the tragic past, right? These used to work for the previous civilization. Like, well, the civilization before us, they enslaved these creatures. Oh. And when these creatures were got out of control, they just uh, dropped the whole mine on them. Oh. Yeah, yeah, so these guys are trapped in here like for 300 years or something like that. Now we came here and we are trying to exterminate them. It's just yeah. a sad story. Yep. I saw a joke about how they're having a party or something and someone suddenly broke a rock from upstairs and they're like, what the fuck? Yep. They can't mm -hmm. have a party anymore. Yep. Sanj. Slaves no more. See, see, see. See, I'm a good voice actor, man. Sure. I mean, <laughs> I was just checking out some food on Swaggy, and I heard. It's like, what the fuck happened here? I mean, that's what that guy is shouting. So, master, smart pay. Love the game, never. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I should do voice acting for monsters. I will fit right in there. Oh no. So good. Yep. Oh no. This reminds me of that one guy um, from Dota. Who? Uh, even he has like four things and he can teleport to one of those. Ah. Uh, what's his name? I think he's one of the only two intelligence characters that uses the melee. Huh. Other one is Ogamashai and I forgot this guy's name. Uh, I guess started again. I was about to ask this stuff. Oh yeah, lady, we just started again. She was about to ask stuff. She was about to ask us about this. I mean, that's what she said. So <laughs> yeah, yeah. This guy is just really pissed at us. Uh, give I mean, me a second. Give me a second. Uh, give me a second. Actually, all our attacks were directed towards his heart. I'm back. Yay! Yay! I learned a new action. Huh. Uh, Which one? The one that is in pen? Uh, this one, arm's length. Creates a barrier that nullifies most knockbacks and drawing effects. Recommended gear. Uh, you're currently equipped. Yari yari. Uh, yeah, exit. New duty. Hmm. Mm, report to Painted Mesa. Painted Mesa? That's what that guy's name. Person. That guy is Papshan, yeah? Yeah, that's Papshan. Who's painting me some? I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, is that guy still here? Is that um, umbrella up on it? Okay, he's not. Huh. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm sad now. Yep. I'm just sad. Yep. Uh. Well, healed youth. What? Okay. 
Uh, where am I supposed to go again? Okay, that way. Ba -ba -ra, ba -ba -ba -ba. Okay, I can teleport to this location. I'm a fucking idiot. There's an ether right there. Oh, well. sand. oh, yeah. Okay, I think this guy is the one who gave us this job. I guess. Uh, duty calls, comments, bat. Why? Parabo. Wait, Papa Shan is the one who gave us the quest. And this, I think this guy works there and he can't anymore. How long are you gonna keep playing this game? Like, till the story is over, I guess? Or if you meant for today, maybe an hour or two? Yeah. Ah, the conquerors of the copper will returns. Ah, so that's what we are. Huh? Thanks to your mining operations can resume. And Ulda will have the materials she needs to rebuild. The entire nation is in your death, my friend. I'll share the good tidings with Papa Shan the next time I see him. As for you, you'll want to report to Mamodi. It'll do the woman well to see you alive and in one piece. Yep, she's like, okay, this fucker is still alive. Uh, no! Uh, yeah. That's the voice I chose for her. She literally screamed here yeah, <laughs> so that you didn't have to. <laughs> yeah. And yet you chose to do it anyway. <laughs> I mean... Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah. Shut your mouth, you thieving little swine. You stole from me. Don't even think to deny it. Okay. His name is obnoxious. Yep. Desperate damsel. Obnoxious. Mercy to desperate damsel. Yep. Please. Please, sir. I didn't steal nothing. I bought this. Paid for it with my own coin. What rot? Your fishes are all the same. Couldn't afford maggoty mole meat. Much less a choice cut of Toto. I'm going to say it one more time. Give back what you stole. Or I'll make you wish you never set foot in this town. By rights, I should turn you over to the brass plates. You know, help keep the streets safe for law-abiding citizens. Hmm. So this guy is like Trump supporter, eh? But I'm very, this guy is like a Trump supporter then. <laughs> yep. I mean, yeah, but I'm a reasonable man. If you agree no, to... Wait, the guy behind him is that guy, right? The one who was just reported to. Maybe or this is just a different guy and they use the same in PC. I mean, could be the case. I, I don't know. Everyone in that I mean, that guy seemed to be a good guy, so I'm not assuming that it's him. Maybe it's just standing there to backstab him or something. Maybe. But I'm a reasonable man. If you agree to serve me, whatever capacity I require, the authorities needn't hear of your crime. So he's just a piece of shit. Ah, this is a different guy. Hello, looks like one of those guys who used to cheat, you know, yeah, whatever maybe. happened on the streets. Yeah, could be that guy. But yeah. I ain't done nothing wrong. Dwell says me witness. Oh no. What are the freaks? <laughs> maybe. Like a literally help or something, you know. He's just uh, a fucking merchant. Yeah. Please, adventure, help me. I beg of you. I swear on me mother's grave. I didn't steal nothing. I bought this with coin I saved. I only wanted to treat me children to a decent meal. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, I'm not even gonna question that. And who the hell are you when you are at home? This dog's master? Okay. Uh... Did they uh -huh. either the battle cry of fury or something there?
pick a pleasant toy it could be a battle cry who knows man sure i had enough of this mama's fuss you lot teach them a lesson ha huh. so are they going to fight us no sure yeah sure why not uh uh yeah. okay it's loading Oh no. He does the same. I had an adventure when this down half out. What? <laughs> I should have stopped at seven tail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to oh, punch you. <laughs> hmm, you're just dead, huh? As simple as that. Hinjaku, hinjaku. Yup, hinjaku, hinjaku. Yup, that's how it stands. Yup. <laughs> I ain't getting paid enough for this. Is yep. out. <laughs> yup. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Hmm. Tanky kind of adventure. Just gone, Tanky huh? tries over. Yeah, like the fuck this shit I'm out. No, I meant our the things in our hands. Ha. Huh. Yep. I just had an answer question said. Yep. I swear if there are more refugees than when I last looked. Okay, I swear there are more refugees than when I last looked, and you wouldn't be mistaken. But it's been five years since the calamity. Why are they? Why are they only coming here now? It's simple, really. Well, a number of hamlets survived the immediate aftermath of the calamity. Many were no longer able to support their communities. The residents found their lands. had either been rendered barren or cut off from the trade routes and the problem like those aren't easily solved though they tried to make best of it it was only a matter of time before they were forced to abandon their homes and seek a new life in the city i see but the calamity affect the whole realm didn't it is the same thing happening in the other cities if the talk is true Yes. Though perhaps our situation is more pronounced. Ulda has reputation for being prosperous, so it's natural that refugees would try their luck here first. My heart goes out to them. It truly does, but I would be lying if I said that I wasn't apprehensive. I hope their presence doesn't form in lawlessness in the city. Yari yari. Well, if things do take a turn for the worse, we always have the mortal flames. I dare say brass plates would welcome their help. The Wait, heroes... where in mortal flames again? Don't. Wait, what? What? Where in mortal flames again? Uh, uh, they are under the command of Robon. He's the general of immortal flames. That's the grand company. Yeah. Uh, what are those brass plates then? Brass plates I think the local security guys I guess like these guards and stuff those are brass plates I guess some some number of companies operate in this thingy and someone sometimes said like those are the people who actually and control not the current or something like that Yeah I think something like that Okay The heroes who fought the Garlin Empire's empire patrolling the streets for riffraff. Okay. It may well come to that. Impoverished and desperate as they are, you may be sure that some of the refugees will turn to crime. You know what this place is like. If you have no coin, you have no hope. 
what will become of our city? Not all refugees are bad, mind you. Some are able to find employment and lead honest lives. Dodo tenderloins. Get chi dodo tenderloins. Guaranteed cheapest in Thailand. Okay, that guy is selling it, huh? Yep. Sure voice salesman. Okay. <laughs> yeah, sure voice salesman. Thank you for. Okay, thank you for your custom, madam. Please come again. So that's what she bought this, I guess. Probably. Yeah. I mean, it's that that's lady, true. right? Yeah, we're having yeah. a vision. So. Yep. Yeah. Looking around, you think that Ulla was well on its way to recovery. But peer through the veil of prosperity, you'll see no end to the misery and suffering. Wait, okay, so uh, I sort of missed that thing in the beginning. Why did it say like the number of refugees start increasing more? Uh, because of the calamity. Uh, up, uh, up till this point, they are trying. They are trying to hold on, like in their villages and stuff. Uh, okay. But because of the calamities, most of the uh, lands became barren and stuff. So they can't earn money anymore. And hmm. the trade routes were cut off uh, because of the destruction and stuff. So they are trying their luck uh, in the city. So they are migrating here. Just five years. Yeah, I mean, they tried to make it work till now, but it's not yeah. working anymore, so they are coming. Uh, uh, madam? Are you alright? Uh, yep, I'm perfectly alright. Alive and kicking. Yep. What now? You mean to threaten a defenseless citizen? Well, how are the turntables? What? Saw her buy that meat, you say? That's absurd. I, As did I. Leave the poor man, poor woman alone, you damnable vulture. Who said that? Wait, who said that? It's like dying in that bit. Yep. <laughs> ah. I will look over this, but just this once. Yeah, please, like, run away. God bless Wait, you. Wait, did that guy just switch sides? Or is it a different one? The guy yes. that he was sharing in the back? Could be, man. After we beat the shit out of him, he's tried, maybe he's trying to blend in there. <laughs> Who knows? He just took off his scarf and he's just blending there now. It does definitely does look like a person who can easily blend in crowds, you know. Yep. <laughs> Not like someone who stands out or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. God bless the adventure. If he hadn't come along when he did, who knows what the monster might have done? I don't bear thinking about it. Yay! We saved the day. Woohoo! Yep. I don't say dancer, it just remind, it reminds me of Fernando. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that stupid voice line, he says, damsel in this dress. Yep. <laughs> All's well that ends well. Okay. Who's that? Okay, it's this guy. Oh, this guy, he's like... He's a yeah, personal... when she had that vision, I was kind of wondering, like, there must be this guy's number around. Yeah. Just lurks around. Yep. We meet again. Sir. Pray do not mistake my intent, for it was always honorable, but I have been watching you ever since you departed Ulla. Yare, yare. Stalker alert. Yep, stalker alert. You played your pa you played the part of the NY to perfection. Confident as a woman on a diplomatic mission should be, yet unfailing courtiers to your betters. And when you travel, when your travels led you into the midst of danger, you faced it without so much as a flinch. You, my lady, are quite a marvel, and I confess to being quite taken with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But with my lavish praise, praise continues. Most of all, I was struck by your readiness to aid those in need. 
even when words were all the reward you could expect to receive such selfless such wait such selflessness is a rare thing in this day and age out of which leads me to conclude that you are indeed the one whom I, I have been looking for an adventure possessed with very rare set of qualities to be sure your rescue of the damsel in distress was more of a happy accident but rescue her you did and that is what matters in the end I feel like I should mention at this point I also harbor a burning interest in a certain talent of yours. I speak of your visions. You have been experiencing visions, have you not? Well, it just happens so that I know a woman who shares your talent and can help you understand it. She and I belong to the same organization and we should both be delighted beyond words if you agree to join our cause. Huh. Naturally, there are benefits to being part of such collective for one we should be glad to assist you in realizing your potential as an adventurer you need not give me your answer now think about it and if you feel moved to help us as i pray you shall speak with mamudi the ever love the ever lovely and youthful mistress of quicksand wait that lady's youthful really i still ask her though what i still ask her Huh. Yep, she is sassy. Yeah. Tell her the signs of the seven dawn have found their woman, and she will tell you where to find us. Hmm. Yeah, apparently, we are gonna. So this organization name is Signs of the Seven Dawn. Easy. Hey, Mamudi, we meet again. Hmm. Seems like there is big. <coughs> Seems like that are becoming even more common. I'm afraid. Don't worry though. If you work hard, you'll probably be all right. Okay. Uh, Looks like she is giving advice to this guy. Yeah. Looks yeah. like a new adventure or something. Yeah. Saying that, if you ever find yourself a, in a spot of bother, come and see me. Just don't go pestering me every time you graze your knee, eh? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Of course, I do enjoy hearing. Tell of supposed gent- to be a joke. Yep. Tell of his gentleman's woe with the woman folk from time to time. Yeah, yeah. Ah, Nick. Sorry to keep you waiting. I was just providing guidance to a fresh off the carriage adventure. But gods, it's good to see you safe and well. To look at you, no one would ever guess you be you'd been hard at it with giants in the dark. I never doubted for a moment that you'd you'd succeed. Of course, and neither did Papa Shan. We changed to say he won't be overjoyed. And before I forget, there is a lass who there is a lass here who wants to have a word with you. Didn't didn't actually know your name, but hearing her description, I knew who she meant right away. Huh? Oh no! I wonder how she described us. Yep. Yari yari. Uh, you remember this lady, right? Oh, yeah. is it that one like we found out here at the dungeons? Yep. Yeah, fi- people were blaming her for something. I can't remember. Uh, her fiance died in the dungeon because yeah, he yeah. leaped in, and she couldn't be able to help him. He yeah, leaped. But... Yeah, that lady. Yeah, but what, what was he blaming her for? Something stupid, but I can't. Remember. That fiance guy. Yeah. Because she didn't buy some potions. And he didn't even give her money and expect her to buy potions or cover the costs of it. Okay. Yeah, that's for uh, and yeah, and he was pissed off at her. Hmm. Yeah. 
cool. I mean, cool. I mean that guy is a dick, so. Yeah, the others left, right? Like. Yep. Yeah, like hmm. fuck the shit I'm out. <laughs> yep. That other lady hates her, and this guy is like, I'm not going to deal with this bullshit, and that's a small lala fell guy. He left. Yeah. That's fair. Yeah. Yes, it's fair. Thank you for sparing your time. I realize I realize you don't know me, but I have been longing to speak with you for a while now. <laughs> My name is Ada. I am an adventurer like you, though I am not very good at being one, if truth be told. Anyways, I was adventuring with my friends in Gridania when when I'm sorry. We were in Gridania when the leader of our party was killed. His name is Aver, and he and I were to be wed in the spring. You may not, you may not remember him, but to say that he remembered you would be an understatement. He would sing your praises from dawn to dusk. Why? That's real. What? For real, I've. I kind of feel bad that is that man. Ha. Huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I mean, he used to sing out praises. It's a dick, but yeah. Huh. yeah, I mean, yeah, the one guy who sing praises for us died. <laughs> no, we have no one. That's it. Yeah, it's GG you now. <laughs> he so saw. <laughs> Ah, uh, just take off your nice operation, maybe. Because, okay. yeah. Um, if my voice is loud enough, maybe you can just reduce the volume a little. I guess I, uh, I believe that helps with the rest of me. Huh. Uh, I think it's fine for now. Let's see. No, that's because I haven't taken off noise operation yet. Ah. Uh... I did it now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, it's fine now. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's see how long it takes. Yep. He saw you. He saw you for what you are. You see, adventurous adventurer, and swore that he would be like you one day. <laughs> nah, man. Nah, you. You see, that ain't it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I believe that he would uh, he would have succeeded had if he not robbed him of the chance. Since <laughs> that day, I have thought long and hard about giving up adventuring. Uh, she doesn't believe a single word she's saying. Famous lie in French when she's like, when you lie, you look down. That's exactly what she did right now. Yeah. <laughs> you see, she was looking up to Allah when she said he would have been robbed of the chance. He was just looking down. <laughs> that <Yeah>. was bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the more uh, most obvious reason is she couldn't able to look us in the eye. I guess. Yep. Because she's sad. Well, that's what we're um, supposed to assume, but that's not what we're yeah. uh, assuming. Nope. <laughs> yeah. We're not assuming. We know for sure. <laughs> huh. Yep. That those are facts. That's it. Yep. Facts. Because Phoebe said so. Yeah. I mean, yeah, true up was his famous work. Yeah. But when I think of the woman you are, of all that you have achieved, I find that I am inspired, just as ever once was. So I've decided to start again as an adventurer. I will go back to village of my birth and begin my training in you. Hmm. But I wanted to meet you first to ask you, you your name. Uh-huh. Yep. Nick it's not Stras. that long, it's just Nick. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Yeah, Nick Stras. I shan't forget. Yeah. Thank you, Nick. I pray that we will meet again. Fare you well. If she doesn't forget the name, like she forgot those portions. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <really. laughs> I mean, that's not on her, man. You <laughs> didn't even give her money. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of feel bad for that guy because he's in your praises. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, that's what it took for you to turn table. Yep, that's all it took. Very, very. Yeah. I'm a simple man, you know. <laughs> Adventuring can be cruel, bleeding business. Time was, 
I didn't know why anyone would bother. When they uh, when they first asked me to take charge of the guild here, I didn't want art to do with you lot. Thought it would be a right pain in the ass looking after you all. But against my better judgment, I decided to accept the post. And I am full glad I did. I feel privileged to be part of your lives. So what, she lives to see us, see our pain and suffering? Hmm. I mean, that's what I got from that. <laughs> she just lives to see this. Oh, well. Yeah. And that go and that goes double for yours. Next. Pain and suffering? Maybe. Hmm. Eh? What did you say? You want to know about Science of the Seven Dawn? Hmm. They are beginning to move in earnest there. Listen, Nix, the science ain't no ordinary folk. The work they do ain't no ordinary work. I know full well how capable you are. But even you would think twice before attempting some of the stuff they do. Knowing that, if you are still certain you want to get involved, I'll tell you what I can. I mean, why not, I guess? Yeah. Not like our life is at stake or something. Yeah. It's not like something is going on with our life, so. <laughs> that too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Momodi said to tell you what she knows about Science of the Seven Dawn. So you want to know more then, do you? Well, ain't that a surprise. I swear, if I painted certain date on the door, and limitless wealth on another, nine of the nine out of the ten adventures would go through the first. And the other bloke wouldn't be able to choose. Yari yari. On the account of being <laughs> Uldan. Wait, what? I didn't get it. Yeah, if there were two options, one is certain death and another one is limitless wealth, nine out of, nine out of ten adventures we choose the first one, certain death. Okay. Wait, what? The other bloke won't be able to choose an account. What does that mean again? Okay, I'm, I'm confused oh, right. now. I'm confused now. Uh, Isn't that so supposed to be opposite? Uh, Wait a certain death on one door and limitless wealth on another. Nine out of the ten adventures would go through the first one. Okay, let's say nine out of ten go through limitless wealth. And the other block wouldn't be able to choose. And I can't have on them. What's that supposed to mean? Uh, I mean, it's a common stereotype that old uh, people of Ulda like riches. Um, so he so he goes through the limitless wealth, right? Like, are people suicidal or something, Uldans? Yeah, I mean that's what I'm getting from this statement. Yeah, so Uldans are su suicidal and greedy. Yep. Well, that is assuming she meant the nine out of ten adventures per second. Yeah. Which I don't think. I think we're missing something out here. Why would nine out of ten adventures go through certain deaths? Because they are idiots, I guess. I mean, we saw that guy, right? Ever. He killed himself in the dungeon. Oh, okay. Yeah, that would be. That makes sense. Okay, fine. Let's just move past it. <laughs> yep. Anyways, didn't say I didn't warn you. First of all, if you're wondering whether you can trust these signs of the Seventh Dawn, you can. They are good people who have made their mission to solve some years' years most pressing problems. Cause that ain't no small task. And so Dude, they, yeah. did I text you? When? Uh... When? Okay, no, 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 no. I just thought about it. I didn't text it. Yeah, yeah. I just, I don't know. I'll just talk about it. Later. Ah. Of course, that ain't no small task, and so they are always looking for dependable individuals to join it. Individuals like you, Nix. Now, I've been given leave to tell you where to find science, but you must promise to keep this information to yourself. 
as you can probably imagine if something yours yours enemies would very much likely to know like to know okay the science are headquartered in vesper bay out in west Danland. the place where you're looking for is called waking sands give a name to whoever saw at the entrance and you'll you'll be let in you are a woman in demand next and yeah really <laughs> And the days ahead promise to be busy, but I hope you won't forget you won't forget your old friend Momodi. Drop in and tell me how you are faring from time to time. You hear? Right. Well, I said my piece. Off you go then. Yeah. So what you gonna remember her now? Sure. Good old Momodi. Yep. <clears throat> I'm still waiting for the moment when she, you know, goes for it and. I don't know, does some weird shit. So, uh, it's probably she... not gonna happen, but still. So, uh, you're expecting that she just gonna teleport behind, teleport behind you and shank you? Yep. Hmm. Like, Fair like enough, cut I up guess. her, I guess. So, you're cut comparing, yeah, you're comparing her with cut up her then. Yeah, sure, yeah. I guess. I mean, that's the worst part is I'm comparing this girl with Bob. But it's... Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess it kind of makes sense as being a protagonist on the still. Yeah. Uh... La 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 la. So what was that? Uh, We're Vesper, going here. Vesper Bay, West Anima. Uh, go to Waking I Sands in Vesper Bay. Yeah, Waking Sands. Science of the Seventh Dawn. Hmm. Science of the Seventh Dawn. Reminds me of Science of House Psycho. You know what the sign of how psycho is? How psycho? Yeah. What? What is that? It's a reference to something. I mean, what's the something again? Uh, you tell me. Sign of how psycho. You know who that is. Oh yeah, I know who that is, but for some reason I can't remember her name. <laughs> Yeah, I can't remember. Mm. Uh, yep. Maybe you should kneel to get your memories back. Kneel. Like I said, I can't remember her name at all. Uh, uh, for the life of me. Uh, much intermender. Yeah. Uh, repair gear. Ah, my gear is fine. Better drink from. <laughs> yep. Um, oh, God, rings been through a lot, I guess. Okay, our gear, our gear is shit. Uh, level 15, level 15, 25. Yeah, it'll be shit. By the way, if I need gear, like, whenever we enter dungeons or something, we're just being downgraded. Nah, health and shit is going down anyway, so... Yeah, but we should at least have gear for current content, right? This is what, level 17. So we should have at least gear level 15, I guess. Because some of our gear is level 1. Look at this, level 1, level 1. Uh, okay. yeah. So are we bringing the eye patch back? Why? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, we can do that, but... I don't think that's a high level gear, right? Yeah, yes, but sir. you can use it as uh, transmog. What? Uh, you can make your gear appear like another gear. That's what transmog is called. Mm -hmm. Yep. Wait. Huh. So, that intelligence and mind, you have nothing to do with those? What is that? <laughs> That's you. Um, 
I don't completely hate that. Huh. Is it weird that I don't completely hate that? Yeah, I mean I don't completely hate them either. So it is what it is, I guess. Yeah, it grew on me so fast. Like I was like, "What the fuck is that?" And I'm like, "That's not bad." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, purchase items. Even cancel what? Uh, okay, it's not that. Potion. But no, not to pay gear. Purchase. Okay, give up. Give up. Yep. Yeah, man. Pataru. So she just had to stand on a chair, huh? <laughs> It's just sad, man. <laughs> I know, right? The chairs were designed for one purpose. <laughs> She can't even do that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Sucks yeah. to be a dwarf. Oh no. I was supposed um, to sing that. Yep. Deep in the desert of my heart, a lonely flower blooms. Oh no! Yeah, I'm just gonna make it creepy. That's it. <laughs> yep. Yearning for heaven's above to quench oh, my geez. thirst for you. Okay. This is creepy. This song uh, is. Um, yep. What the fuck? Tro lo 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 lo. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> It's like <laughs> okay, can't. <coughs> wow. Well, I guess some people just jump a little bit in their chair, and if you're standing on a chair, this is it. you get. Hmm. Uh, that's, that's, that's kind of legit, I guess. <laughs> okay, I would thank you not to sneak upon me like that. <laughs> Now, please be advised that this is a private property. Unless you have a pertinent business here, I must ask you to. Yeah. <laughs> Who the hell is gonna take us seriously with that shit? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Yeah. Here at the be behest of tank, right? My sincerest apologies. May I please have your name? Yep, she could able to figure out from that. <laughs> Maybe our eyesight is bad, man. Uh, damn it! <laughs> no, not that. It's like the way she motioned towards the book. <laughs> Look into that, you piece of shit. Nick Stras, Nick Stras. Ah, here we are. Here you are. <clears throat> I bid you welcome to Waking Sands, headquarters of Science of the Seventh Dawn. My name is Tataru. And I look forward to assisting you during your time with us. Yay! Yay. The, antece the antecedent. That's how. That's how you pronounce it, right? Um. What's an antecedent? Yeah, that's how you pronounce it, I guess. But the antecedent oh. is within the solar. I shall let her know to expect you. So I guess that's a leader? position or something. Leader of this group, I guess. It's within the solar. What's the solar supposed to be? Is it supposed to be the building? I think it's supposed to be the place. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, probably. Antecedent is that a word? Probably isn't. I mean, it's in this game, so it's probably is a word. It might as well could be a role given to something, something. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Amigo. I think it's before. Yeah. I take it you so are Nick. I take it you are Nick Stras. 
Tataru sent word that you have arrived. Lady Minfilia is eagerly wait awaited your coming. Okay. This way if you please. Uh what should I get? Uh just put that thingy is that left side thingy the previous dialogues just leave it that that one. This one? Yep. Uh I'm just fine. Stuff. Esper be etherite ticket. Hmm. Which one should I pick? Okay, I can try them on here. Wait. Mm -hmm. Uh, leather ring bands. Okay. They monetize. Okay, this is how they look. Um. Um. What? They may have this? like coils or something. Oh no! This looks I like shit. This is shit. Absolute shit. I'm just gonna take that. Oh, wait. Let me check this one out. Uh, this eh. okay. Yeah. Too heavy for her. Yay! <laughs> この赤月の結名の名手です。待ってたわ。え、メンタリアスノットワンハウスハビングビジョンズ、マイカウスレインズ。あ、I <laughs> いろいろ聞きたいことはあると思うけど。まずは私たち赤月の結名について説明した方がいいかしらね。私たち赤月の結名は国家間の垣根を越えてエウルゼア全土で活動している団体です。私たちの目的は神々に愛されて<笑> この あなたはこれまでにこんな経験をしたことがないかしら。ノイズのような感覚。何かに吸い込まれるような感覚。まるで幻のように浮かび上がる風景。アメン。それこそがあなたの能力。精神の壁を越え、相手を見ることができる。超
あなたの能力超える力は万神への切り札ともなるもの万神問題を解決するため世界を救うために必要な力よあなたがエオルゼアを歩く冒険者として何を求め何になりたいのか私にはわからないでもこの先も冒険者として生きるためにはもっとエオルゼアを知る必要があるでしょそしてそのエオルゼアには万神問題がある私たちと行動して万神問題を追うことはエオルゼアを知るのに最も近道だと思うわ More the merrier, I guess. Um, I guess the only purpose of this power would be to I don't know if they apprehend someone, a p o p e t or something, you can look into the past and know the stuff. Yeah, and it's not like they'll come across millions of them. Uh, the ones that they come across, she can just look into them. Yeah, yeah,、huh. maybe the more the merrier kind of works here does if they apprehend a lot of people, then yeah, that kind of makes sense. Naturally, your aid will not go un- unrewarded. We are fortunate to have a number of influential allies. At a word from me, they will gladly afford you certain privileges that might otherwise be denied you. The right to employ retainers, for example. Are you familiar with them? They are individuals who may be relied upon to manage your assets and belongings on your behalf. I... The papers you requested, my lady. Oh,、huh, okay. I thought she approached us and she was going for a fist bump or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she just gave papers, that's it. I know it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Tataru. The pleasure is mine, my lady. <laughs> you remember that scene in office where、uh, Pam just comes in and hands him a,、um, a slip to seem like it's important or something, saying that、oh, someone、yeah. just dropped you a message or something like that? Yep, I remember that scene. It's, it's like that, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Just that she actually forgot the paper. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they couldn't able to do that in this cutscene, so.、Yep. The, the, these are old animations. They couldn't able to. They didn't have tech for that at that time. Tech for what? Uh, they couldn't able to render the paper. These. Oh, the paper. Okay. Yeah. 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 Uh, all the, I mean, this entire thing is achieved through in game emotes. Like, all of these are emotes that are available to players. They use、oh. those emotes to, you know, do these cutscenes and stuff.、Mm-hmm. Yeah.、Okay. So that's why they couldn't be able to add,、uh, add those stuff.、Oh. Yeah. By the way, of, Wait, this game is like, what, five years old or something? It's released in 2013. Yeah, okay, but even at that point in time, this was a really popular franchise, right? Yeah, it was. But、so、the thing is,、uh, this game had to be released to PS3. So,、okay. in order for that to happen, they downgraded it a lot.、Mm. This game has many assets and、uh, many animations and stuff. So, if you are going to add、uh, more to it, like for example, that pa- if you add if you are going to add that paper, it's going to、mm-hmm. increase the pixel count. And、uh, in turn, it will affect the amount of RAM taken by PS3. And PS3 couldn't be able to handle that. So, they had、yeah. to you know, downgrade it. Gotcha, gotcha,、yeah. gotcha. That was one of the limitations, you know, having it on PS3. Hmm. Gotcha. Yeah. By the way, of welcoming gift, I, take, I have taken the liberty of adding your name to the retainer's registry. As of now, you are entitled to employ the services of a retainer. You will need to consult a retainer vocate regarding the particulars of this arrangement. 
but believe me when i say that the retainers will prove invaluable to you in your adventuring endeavors let this case let this gesture serve as an evidence of our commitment to all in our power to facilitate your personal objectives in return we ask that you aid us in the fullest extent of your talents got any personal objectives nope i mean we still have the tall guy to deal with i guess that okay. guild guy come on uh uh you know the uh, war come on yeah come on that guy Wait, so that is our objective what <laughs> i mean beside this so that's, that's what our life has become huh yeah it's either this or that so <laughs> we don't have much of a choice <laughs> whatever is life anymore yeah a mutually beneficial relationship i'm sure you'll agree and one which will serve sure. the greater good besides <laughs> i mean she she is sure so yeah. well that was the vegetable lecture was it not forgive me but it is important that all concerned are aware of what is expected of them now you know you know that you know your purpose and what we can offer you i invite you to consider joining us what is the desired purpose she she what is expected from her she never said what's expected from us uh she wants us to help Uh, yeah i know but in what capacity i mean with our ability i guess i mean we can peer yeah, into people's past and yeah, we are a capable adventurer so you know ha huh. yeah i mean i'm just saying she didn't go into the specifics of this ha huh. yeah <laughs> she didn't give us a good job description and she's trying to sign us in yep Yeah, yeah. It mean, sounds like I've got it. Yep. I invite you to consider joining us when you have when you have come to a decision. You may tell me without fear of censure. Hmm. In good faith, I shall entrust you with our order's password, which our members use to reach one one another when afield. Okay. It is Wild Rose. Pray keep it safe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, now we have our own password. Yep. Ah, Manalika. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hiring a retainer. Uh, retainers are helpful in pieces who can be hired by player to carry out such tasks as storing excessive gill gear and selling unwanted <laughs> items on market. You have excessive <laughs> gill and gear, mate. Yeah, it was exactly about to ask. I got an excess of gear. <laughs> I mean, I guess the number is decent enough right now. Yeah, it is. Like it's say eight point six k. Yeah. Well, I mean, at one point of time, you're fucking poor, man. Like hundred gillons. Cheap. Yep. That was miserable. I mean, <laughs> I guess it just takes like what, five or six teleportations for this to be exhausted. Yeah. I mean, it's a teleport to all the lands. Like, I don't know. Oh no. Was Dark Knight followed me. Uh, Yo, Dark Knight, how are ya? Ah. Oh, yeah. Dark Knight. That, yeah. Um, what's that? What's that? Jaren's friend. His username. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. His username on Discord. So something to do with NPR. Yeah, and BK Mao or something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> The, with that triple K, I thought that was really fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Minifilia. We sons have one, but one objective: to safeguard the future of Eosia. Among our greatest concerns are godlike beings known as Primals. Long have we striven to find a lasting solution to the threat they pose. I know, I know not what it is you desire for yourself, but nor what it is that. First brought you to Eosia, but I firmly believe that the power we possess was given to us for a purpose. Huh? We consider this when you give me your answer next. Okay, why is she being so redundant? Oh well. So, what are you gonna choose? Uh, I will go with the with the wild rose blooms. Yours is no smaller than the one. 
<laughs> so how are you going to respond to that? <laughs> this is just straight up obnoxious. <laughs> you are just most smaller. They were at the day. Just a great. I mean, I think this means I'll go where the science go. I guess like Wild Rose is supposed to be science, right? Like that's the password. But. What is what's that supposed? I'll go where the wild rose blooms. I'll go where the science appear, or something like that. No, weather is like weather down, right? Like I don't know something like you say the the things weather means they grow old and die or. Uh, I mean. Oh, I... that's novel. Yeah, it's yeah, it's not novel. Yeah, it's it's a different word. It's just some ancient word. Yep. Okay, okay. I'll Maybe go the, where I think. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's supposed yeah, yeah. to be where. Yeah. Like, something like that. Yeah, right, right. Yeah. Um, which is much smaller. The dangers are great. Or nothing. Do it. Everything. Yeah, just let's just go with nothing. Let's see what it does. Nope. The quest doesn't progress. We have to give her an answer. <laughs> Dang, nah, but. Uh, um, yours is no smaller, and the, let's just go with the dangers are great. Let, let let's be like um, you know, not not commit to anything. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's be vague about it. Yep. Um, what do you call that? Equanimity? No, no, no. Huh. Equanimity is something else. The dangers. Equivocal. Are great. Yeah, equivocal. Hmm. They are. Yet the risks we take are justified, given that which is at stake. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> okay. So we have to yeah, give. Yeah, that was a... too vague for her. Yeah. Go with the second option. I'll, I'll, I'll not say that first. <laughs> if I can help it. Small? No. Worthy? Undeniably. We labor for the good of all the realm. So we have to give the first. <laughs> we have only yeah, one choice. choice. Matters, you know? Choice is an illusion, man. <laughs> Yeah. Oh man, like I randomly switched to XQC stream, I guess, watching this game, The Quarry. Okay. And that's more or less a linear game. Whatever choice you pick, it just goes just one way. Hmm. So yeah, I just, whenever he picks some other choice that the game doesn't want him, like, and it just goes one way, I see that spam chat choice matters. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, well, yep. I will go with the the wild rose blooms. Yep. Yeah, yeah. I can't believe I'm saying that. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, I wasn't given much of a choice. Yeah. Oh no! Your voice is. Oh no! The thingy is leaking My again. Voice? Um, as in you're getting a raise on or something? Yeah, I need to do um, some. Should I, I just turn the suppressor and off it again? Yeah, do that. Oh no, way! I think it's the problem of my internet or something because I just had a single, single bar till now. I don't think so. I think it's the fault of the mic. That's it. It's a hardware issue, like uh, leaking and stuff. Huh. Um, do I just switch back to my old one because I saw those headphones nearby somewhere? I can, I guess, drop. I think it will be fine now. Okay, let's see. Uh, wonderful. Deva, Aratamete, Akatsuki no Ketsume no Nakamatachi or Shokashinaka Sharean. So what? She just said Akatsuki, right? Yeah. Does that mean friends or something? Akatsuki, I think science, uh, science of Seven Dawn in Japanese. That's what they are called, Akatsuki. Huh? Yeah, I mean, I mean it's a, it's a Akatsuki. translation thing. They translated yeah, it differently for English speaking audience. Ah, so yeah. they literally roll with Akatsuki, huh? Yeah. Because Akatsuki is a thing in Naruto. Yeah, yeah, I know. Like, that's yeah. supposed to be the name in Japanese, but for some reason they chose Science of the Seven Dawn for English speaking audience. 
エルゼア六大都市の一つ。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャーリエン。シャ
クリスタル強奪事件と誘拐事件ってところね本来こういった事件は治安維持も務めるグランドカンパニーの仕事だわでもこの事件おそらく万心が絡んでいる現場に残っていた手口おそらく死亡者はウルダハに住むアマルジャ族だああアマルジャーどうすリザルピープルだってビアンコンタクト like at the starting エヴィデンスインプリケーションオーケーアマルジャ族にはクリスタルを強奪したり人を誘拐する理由がある、no. それこそが万神関連ってわけだ Yeah, so you were saying? So, what are the primals supposed to be? Are they like some monsters or something? Or like... I think they will explain. Okay. 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 俺に任せてくれよろしくなそう、あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。あたし、サポーズとビサンツマーケンですよ。Ah, sure, it means anything at all. Okay. Yeah, something like that, I guess. Yeah.、Mm, know you out of this fellow youngster. Okay. Huh. I think primals. Let's see. If they don't explain it later, then I'll tell you what they are. I guess it's the monsters because she said, like, the others, like. I'm all、uh, just worship them. I'm all just worship them. Oh. Okay, so that weird name that they worship, that is a,、um, a, a primal. Yeah. Something starting with, a, with an I. Yeah, Ifrit. What? Ifrit. Ifrit. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that one. Gotcha. Re ready to begin, are we? That's the spirit. So then, your mission is to investigate a crystal robbery and a spate of abductions. Crimes which are which we believe to be connected. Assuming that we are correct, it is like it is like that any discoveries we make in relation to one will further our understanding of the other.、Hmm. Now, since the attack on the cavern, our friends at Amajina and Sons Minerals concern have doubt double security over all their shipments. In light of this, it is my judgment that the abduction should be our priority. According to our preliminary findings, the majority of the missing were last seen in the vicinity of Camp Drybone. So, that would seem a fine place to begin. A fellow named Isembat、yeah, serves as the Camp de facto leader. Pay him a visit and see that he gives us his full cooperation. Food. Yeah, Furu Corporation. Camp, dry, camp Drive One, huh? Yep. It's one way to name, I guess. Yeah, can I teleport、uh, there? Yeah, hold on, I'll just go P and come. Uh, I'll go P and come. I'll just teleport there meanwhile.、Uh, so, how much gil does that take? I took like what? 320 gil?、Huh, that's a lot of gil.、Ah, yeah. We are the right back. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Stop here. Your adventure is split.
Keitlin. Huh. Hmm, by chance, pulse weapons. Nothing for me. It's level nineteen. You know there's this company called Needful Rolls out here. What? There's this not company but there's this restaurant called Meatful Rolls. Okay. They don't sell a single roll. That's a scam. Yep. That, like the no, not at any point in day on any day like they, they don't sell a single roll at all. <laughs> then why? I know. I don't know. Like they they sell some chicken wings or some. That's not a walking roll. Or something. No, nope, it's not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's just. You know, whenever I open Swiggy, I open the restaurant always. You know, five going to five hundred. Just to check that. Okay. I yeah, <laughs> but no. <nope. laughs> yeah, Every just, single time. Yeah, misleading marketing. Yep. Yeah, we maybe we should complain it to a CC or something like that. Yeah, sure. Yeah. So uh, shall we continue? Yeah, yeah. Isambardo. I am Isambard. Here to search for missing folk. I take it. Mirfila sent the word that an adventure fitting your description would be along. She also warned us to be wary of Amalja. It seems we it seems we know who the culprits are at the very least. Now, I bear no official title at this camp, but the people here have come to look to me for leadership. Yeah, you have my word that I'll do all I can to help see the victims return safely. Hmm. This is still Ulda, right? Yeah, this is still Ulda. Mm, okay. Let us get right to it then. Minfilia, na Minfilia names the Amalja as culprit in all this. You would do well to investigate them first. Hmm. Much harm has been levied on these lands by Amalja's hands. The flames burn with them. The flames burn where they might, but their light cannot stay in darkness in all places at all times. What does that even mean? I they guess have... he's referring to those people. Yeah. There have been brutal murders of callers at the church of Saint Adama Landama. Okay. Inno... <laughs> Innocence wish no more than to pay respects to the dead. The poor souls deserve a proper burial. 
I would see to that deed before mongrels catch their scent. But I know not if Amal just still linger. Would you secure the remains or would you secure the remains for me, friend? Mm -hmm. You will find them on the eastern road. Okay. Twelve spelling. You may even come to learn something what Amalja seek in this area. Hey. Wait, we're seeking the remains of people who died. Keeping it safe, I guess. Uh, there have been brutal murders of callers at ch church. Apparently, there are some brutal uh, murders at this church. Yeah, I mean, we, we, are, we are to look for their remains or something. Yeah, maybe we should go there and safeguard them. No, uh, uh, the dead bodies. That's what we're supposed to. Yeah, apparently. I mean, because they deserve a proper burial or something. Yeah. We have to get rid of those cadavers. Yep. <laughs> something like that. Yep. Walk. Ba 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 ba. Okay, where am I supposed to go? I'm just gonna... Huh. Butch. Oh no. Let me increase the volume a little bit. Um, system configuration. Ripe cops, huh? So, you're supposed to safeguard them? Level 12. That's how we retrieve corpses. We just put them in our pockets. That's it. Yep. Might as well bury them there. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. Yippee! Yeah, you're you so dressed me. in pockets. <laughs> yeah, really. yeah, it's good to see you return. Were you able to secure the remains of a fallen? Oh no, they you they using flower, huh? For that. With the bodies given back proper to the earth, the souls will find their way across the other side. You have done a noble deed this day. I thank you. Now then, what of Hamalja? Did you see any? Surely such massive monstrosities as they cannot conceal their presence, much less take their quarry and ways. Yari yari. Ah, so they were Amalja's remaining, after all. I feared as much. Their part in the their part in the low bone disappearing is all but confirmed, but I sense there is more to this than meets the eye. The occasional Amalja raiding party would not account for the people going missing in these kinds of numbers. The total is too great, and the questions too many. I would not be it would not surprise me in the least to learn of another hand at this. Another hand in this. But who? Hello, at least give a spoiler alert or something. Huh. Yare yare. But whose? Countless travelers pass through dry bone every day. And even if they, <coughs> even if it were uh, one among them, how would we best discover who may implicit these vanishings? Hmm. Yeah, I leveled up, sir. So. Yay. 
and at some point of time we have to do our job quest too so uh yes is it not part of our job quest mm no nope. our job quest we have to meet that hamon guy ah uh, so where is the thing even stop i think hamon is due to fight someone right like yeah. they put up some domes or something Yeah, and as long as we beat the shit out of him, somehow he levels up. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. As yeah. I, I think he said he would train or something for. Yeah. Uh, the other guy who left him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm kind of remembering things. Yeah, yeah. I got this. I've got this. <laughs> I've got this. What say be done and I to the common folks themselves? It may be among them that we find the reason for these vanishings. Tall for a bit, it be so. There is a merchant by the name Angust who was born here in Drybone and grew up in the Golden Bazaar. A rough character, but he knows the people here better than anyone else. At wager he is at the inn, quaff, quaffing away the day's earnings. Here, I'll write a note for you to show him. Else, he's not like to speak to you. Hmm. Huh? So he's gonna read, huh? He's gonna read a note. Yep. While he, he was drinking. Speak to us or not? Yep. That's how it works. Yep. He's gonna read while he's drinking. That's how it works. Uh. Okay, I'm supposed to go in this tavern, I guess. Uh, amigo. Oh no! It's this piece of shit. What the? Yari yari. So we have to meet with him, huh? No? <laughs> Blah. Well, God speed, damn! You are that bloody adventurer who threatened me back in Ulda. What in the seven hells do you think you want with me now? We should just threaten him for information. Even. Yeah, I mean, he knows our strength, so. Yeah. Dear friend, blah. Missing people, please help. Hiccup. Okay. <laughs> I can't replicate you hiccup. A, you nope, got a pelt and hiccup, you know. How man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yours is embarrassed. Folks around here are as wary as they come. They'll turn tail and run if you so much as pass wind. Pass wind nearby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Play them, play them all for fools and cocks. Some hard labor out of them, I did. Okay, if anything, they they are even more timid than before. And what with all the disappearances, you can go talk to them yourself if you don't if you don't believe me. Okay, so practically helped us with nothing. Yep. Oh, what did you expect from this? Oh no, it's the hungry beggar. <laughs> hey, oh man! Please, miss, just leave me be. Ah, that's not Trademark how you so. <laughs> that's not how you beg. Uh, I guess this beggar is a chutzpah. Yeah, I mean, like, how does that work? <laughs> <laughs> like you try to give him money and he's like just leave me alone. You <laughs> that's <easy. not> <laughs> uh, his and he's with the begging, you know, and like he just called it a day and he appeared out yep. of nowhere. He disappeared. That's it. <laughs> uh, devious derelict. Huh? Supposed to be devious, huh? I have nothing to say but this. Tall. Take who or whatever been feeding off a slow folk. What? Wait, 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 wait. What? Where, where are you reading it from? Oh, okay, okay, okay. This one. I think they got delayed a bit. Huh. Okay. Tal take who or whatever, whatever's been feeding off a slow folk. What does that even uh, mean? Tal is like the god, right? Yeah. Um, Tal's boss. Whatever the reason for the trouble, he wants that god to take it away. Yes. Maybe. I mean, that's what it means. Petrified pauper. Oh no, he's petrified. <laughs> you petrified me. Yep, he is. 
<laughs> he's petrified. Yeah. What? What do you want from me? I don't know anything. I swear, please don't kill me. Okay, why would I kill you, man? For God's sake, he was standing oh, right no. in front. Oh no! He ran away. Okay, he ran. <laughs> yari yari. So, uh, so that's what I get, huh? Oh, what the fuck! Sweet affairs. I have to talk to this dipshit again. Just as I told you, wasn't it? The whole, the whole lot of them were terrified. <laughs> yeah, there has been talk. There's been talk of the folk getting abducted, but if you ask me, they seem. They simply up and moved on to a better place. This place isn't exactly Costa del Sol, if you know what I'm saying. Okay. Ah. So everyone in this town has that disappearance of it. That's nice. Hmm. Hey, you is bad. Welcome back, Nix. Have you learned lot of import? I see. I suppose I should have expected as much from August. Well, another thought occurred to me in our absence. The common folk are nothing if not fervent in their religious beliefs. Perhaps if they speak free, if they speak freely to their gods, then the clergy may know something of use. Ah, ah. Uh, it's okay. Dog shit. The fuck. <laughs> The stock shit. And this is. I just will put a watermelon or something instead. No, she's one woman. Ah, nice. But how does it go with that ice thingy? That burglar. It doesn't. Ice. It's either that ice thingy or this oh, one. Oh, okay. Let's roll with this. I don't think. Okay. What do you even call that shit? Tiara? It's Maybe I don't know. I guess we just call it that. Yeah. Uh, I look like you, man. Oh, I thought he was someone for a second. Huh. If we if we would know what what the common folks speak of to their cause, we have no better place to us than the church of Saint Ada Adamalandam. Okay. It is a small and humble church found to the northwest of here. So as long as you are headed there, might I ask you to deliver this embalming corpse? What? Okay, a morbid request, I grant you, but it must be born to burials. And I trust none <laughs> more than you to see it done. What if you give yeah, it to another maybe. towns? No, if you give it to another townsfolk, they are just gonna vanish with the corpse or something yep. instead of delivering it. Yep. <laughs> like why? Uh, I don't know, sell their organs or something. Yeah. So he, he trusts no one here. It's kind yeah. of sad, you know. <laughs> Seek out a ma man named Marcus. He tends to the graves of Lichyard. He will tell you where the bodies is to be interred. Okay. Supposed to go that way. Oh no, I'm going in the wrong direction. So I have to go this way. Yeah, I'm supposed to go this way. Yay! It sounds the way. Man, I forgot the early story completely. 
They're just digging here, huh? That's a sad video, I guess. Yep, it's supposedly sad. Yep, he's ditch. It's not pissed here, Uncle. Technically, the car. Oh, fuck, where did he come from? <laughs> Who? This guy. Huh. Okay, just randomly appeared out of nowhere, right? No, no, he's just... there. Yeah. Huh, okay. Yeah, uh, Uncle technically cousin tries removed, but who's counting? We're too busy dividing up that. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck, man? Okay. Whoa. You piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she's worried about. So, oh, yeah. Whoa. Yeah, everyone has sought to in his life on top of an experiment brother that is an... Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna read everything. Yeah. Ayo, Marcus. A Marcus, yes? A body? Of course. There. There have been so many bodies of late. I apologize, miss. If you seek a place of burial, then... There is an empty grave atop the ridge. Take the path and lay him rest there. Okay. Yes. Oh, why don't why does this just straight up give off sin? So we don't have to miss again. Graveside. So what we're digging. Yep. We do everything ourselves these days. Ta-da! What is the... What's the bomb they were supposed to mean? I have no idea. Chendu bomb? Yeah, it's Chendu bomb corpse. The deed has been done. May they walk in Tal's room. What? Missing people? I'm afraid I cannot help you. But me but maybe sister also can. She has been kind to me. Everyone everyone. Everyone has been kind to me. Okay. I don't know why though. Pardon me. You will find sister also within the church wall. So everyone are kind to him? Yep. No one wants to be his enemy. Maybe. Hey, yo, sister. I hear you have done us the service of burying a fallen soul. Please accept our gratitude and ex extend it to Isambard when you next see him. Hmm? You seek knowledge of missing tribal inhabitants. It is true that I am closer to people than any other of the order. I, can, I confide in them and they in me. When they wish to speak to their keeper, Tal, I am the medium through which they do. Hmm. Should I learn anything pertinent, I will be sure to share information with you. <sighs> I only wish Marcus would be more helpful in that matter. I pray he did nothing too often. He saw terrible things during calamity. His scars run deep. Indeed, he seems to now prefer the company of the dead over living. Yari, yari. While, tra while tragic, I fear such behavior ill befits the church. I received words not long ago that one of her recent visitors, a man called Tancred, I believe, took offense at his conduct. I must have more. I must have words with Marcus, and soon. Okay. Why is Tancred here again? Maybe those Amalja's investigations led him to here too. Mm. Oh, that's what I'm assuming. Maybe there's more to it than meets the eye. Yeah, this guy is still digging.
Let me take it to sales spot over and over again. Yep. And the Garrett Besser will be crying like the rest of the world. Uh, yeah, that lady, she just wanted to be done and he's just digging for her. <laughs> it's like almost there, just another dig. <laughs> Is there a way that guy, Sankrat, he went to investigate something else, right? What? He? He was assigned something. Uh, I but this I was this us. happened previously, so it must have this happened, happened. some time ago, I guess. During oh. his investigations. Maybe. But, but I forgot what was he assigned to. Uh, I think he was assigned to investigate this, I guess, uh, regarding Amalja. Assigned to something else. Like this, we are we are doing this, right? Yeah, we are assisting. Resisting? No, I thought she said you take the leadership on this or something. Huh. Uh, I'm mixing two different things. Ah, never mind. Let's just go forward. Yep. Thank you, Nix. A burial is no easy thing, even when the departed is a stranger. Are you able to learn art from the missing common folk? Art of the missing common folk? I think this is the oh, first no. time. I'm... He's here. Hi. Tancred. Tancred is... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, he's the one speaking now, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have been keeping yourself rather busy of late, haven't you, Nix? He's here. A pleasure, my dear is in Isambard. The name is Tancred, and I share a passion with you and our mutual friend here of learning what has become of this missing person and why. I too spoke uh, spoke with Angust more times than I care to count. There seems to be some truth to the notion that common folk speaking their secrets only to those service of ser in service to the gods. Hmm. Prostration, prayer, penance, abject deeds done behind closed doors, away from praying eyes. Who better take? Who better take the pious unawares than she who takes confessions? The good sister or sins herself? Okay, I need to. Oh, Siren. She wouldn't. She couldn't. Wait, what am I missing here? Hmm, it seems to be found some good emotion that I'm for speaking. Things are not good. These come behind closed doors, away from prying eyes. Better to take your son away than she who takes confession. A good sister and herself. So he's accusing Osirin then. Yeah, but yeah, let's just go on. Yeah, that that's something I guess. Ah. Even the most beautiful, even the most beautiful roses have thorns, my friend. And you would. So I guess it's... so. She knows of their mistakes. So how is that connected to them being the, them going missing suddenly? So uh, is she like holding them hostage or something? Something like maybe. using the thingies against the confessions against them to, to I don't kidnap know, them? Keep them hostage? Yeah. Yeah, maybe something like okay. that. I mean allegedly so. Yeah. Still, the list keeper Marquess, I swear to that wall, I have seen that face elsewhere before. Okay. This is Yare. <laughs> this is Yare Yare. <laughs> I think this is just shit. I'm just gonna take Gil. Isambard! Sister Austin, it cannot be. Though she's want to travel to the Golden Bazaar on her own. And it is not uncommon to see her speaking to the children. But no, it could not be she, could it? Hmm. I grow weary of the suspicions. 
I know there is one child in particular that she's fond of. Please seek out the boy, Nix, and see if you cannot clean something from him about our friend's activities. Okay. So, so I was just going off on that hint, yeah. So I think we are suspecting her because she is the one who knows most about these villagers. In the end, I think yeah. she's just a suspect. So. Mm. Yep. Okay. Where the fuck is that boy? Again? Yo, boya. Oh, yo. Do you call it? Okay. What is that? Tuko? Tuko Tuko? This one. That's it. Yeah, it's Tuko Tuko. The fuck is that? Yeah. I okay, don't. I thought the plant is literally growing on its. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Why? So, how to murder him, huh? Yep. Tuko Tuko is pissed. Well, not Tuko Tuko is dead. Tuko Tuko was pissed. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> la la la. La la la. Pa, 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 pa. Okay, this is Chocopo Porta there. I think we can go from here. Ooh, chocobo. Uh, I read chocobo, but uh, okay, there's only one place. That's Ulda. I like so, this thing. This is so cool. What things again? Chocobos. Huh? Yeah, they're cute little chickens. No, they look so prehistoric yet not at the same time. Ah. Pa, 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 pa. So, where's that boy? Boa. In another village, I guess. Yeah, where but... is the boa? So, why aren't we taking Chocobo again? Uh, that Chocobo doesn't ride to that location. Yeah, that's just Satch. Hmm. So how did you figure this whole game when you were playing it for the first time? Just on my own, just uh, I, read, I read everything. Uh, Because like the third guest or something, like like tuning to the AC rates or something. Yeah, I Did mean. Never explain that shit. Yeah, I mean you get some tool tips here, right? Occasionally, like your what you are supposed to do, like you are supposed to read all of that stuff. I'm yeah. just not reading this because I already know that stuff. Yeah, all this shit was explained in there. Okay. Uh. Uncombed Achin? So he's uncombed. Huh? <laughs> and this motherfucker uncombed is a turnip. Oh, shoot. Well, at least he's combed, I guess. Yeah? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Please help. Sister Nausen went out. Where? Okay, Sister Nausen went out all on her own and has come back. She always reads. She always reads to me here about Tal and the order on the other side. I told her I lost my shiny thing and she went looking for it. But what if the monsters outside hurt her? Please find her. So she, he you said shiny thing and she's like uh, say yep, no I more. Gotcha, homie. <laughs> <laughs> say no more. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Yeah, yeah. So that's so how that shit works. Yep. Let's try anything. I know exactly what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no. Oh, sre. Rotting it's pike. No, it's nail Christmas. <laughs> You, you are the one from the church. Thank goodness you arrived when you did. It seems my gratitude is yours yet again. We spoke with a child, yes? Well, I was able to find his lost trinket. It was a ring given to him by his mother before she passed. I will see it safely back to him. Okay. You know, I somehow guess she's gonna unhood and we see a second head in the back. Wait, what? She'll remove her hood and there will be a second head and like Voldemort. It's going to be a second head, huh? Yep. So I heard it correctly first time then. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, yeah, I'm missing something here, <laughs> but nope. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Chocopo keep. Okay, I have to register to this place at least once, I think, before I can. I have to register this location. But, uh. uh the Chocopo water. Yeah. Camp drive on. Yay! And it only costs one kill, so. Oh, look at it, guy. Yep. So cool. <laughs> yeah, he's just doing his best. <laughs> I mean, look at him. Uh, every day is a struggle. gonna get down here. Uh, I'm hungry. Woohoo! <laughs> Come on, grab some sneakers. Don't go them. <laughs> this tall swing was attacked outside the Golden Buzzer. Cost forfeit. I will secure a room at the inn for her should she require any rest. Home. Searching for the mementos of offense. And risking her own well being in doing no less. Certainly not the dastardly deeds thank God have us believe. I sauce him more, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You sauce who more? Uh this guy whose name starts with an I. Oh. Like what? whose name starts with start with vowel. Hmm. What the fuck is this though? Uh, okay, now she looks like a beggar. That's what it is, beggar's clothing. Yeah, I'm just gonna take Gil again. This boy seems to have a message for you from Tancred. Okay. I'm well glad I... I'm well glad I reserved that in room for Sister Sos Sister Oslin. It seems she received great uh, great injuries from the attack she initial than she initially let on. Thankfully she is expected to make a full recovery. But now on the matter at the hand matter at hand, Tankrat came looking for you once more. He left a word that he will be waiting at Amal just camp encampment to the southeast. I pray that two of you are able to uncover some evidence regarding these disappearances. Okay. What's with the pose at the end? Hmm. Maybe that's how he deals with shit. <laughs> okay, I need to.
Uh, which way am I supposed to go? This way? Oh, yeah, this way. Southeast. Easy compass. What the fuck? What happened? What the fuck? What's that name? My Ochigas <laughs> Nanny. Yeah. My Ochigas Nanny. Hey, I'm with the brain of the person that came up with this. He's <laughs> like, what's that? And he named it my nanny. I mean, there's like when you're when you're thinking of a creature to design, like you, you would have as some thing, you know, like you have <laughs> some idea as to what you would. What's it what called? That thing. Yeah. Yeah. I guess that guy was like, okay, let's just randomly draw thing. Whatever comes of it, we'll name according. And then I drew that. Just, just look at that thing. Why is it like? What even is that? Let's have a closer look. Oh no! It's China. like nope. <laughs> like what the fuck is that? Is that a goat? Like, is is, is that a mutated goat? Could is that be. Taurus? Is that? Could be. Uh... I mean, it's bigger than us, so. Sure, okay, fine. Like he came up with something, something went wrong somewhere, and he came up with this shit. <laughs> yeah. Decided to call it a nanny. Yep. Maybe it reminded him of his nanny. <laughs> That's why. Okay, some childhood he must have had. Like I guess that ex. Yep, that explains it. Yep. That's where things went wrong. Ah, there you are, Nick. So good of you to come. Indeed, I have heard all about good sister Oswin. Isambard said her wounds were serious. It would seem her it would seem my suspicions about the poor rose were misplaced. Uh, but the uh, but false though they were, perhaps my suspicions were not entirely without merit. Whilst following Sister Oswin near the Golden Bazaar, a band of Amalja caught my eye. I tracked them as far as this encampment, but well let's just say that I would much prefer to keep my distance and remain here. This, of course, bring me why I requested you, dear Nix. Would you be so kind to take a look inside? What a pussy. What? What a pussy. Yep. Yeah, I'm just... So I but... guess he doesn't have any combat abilities or something? I mean, oh, yeah. he can fight though, right? Like he Yeah, he can. Dragon sort of thing. In the yep. Or exactly that weird void scent thing. Yeah, yeah, that one. Don't mind me, I'm just sneaking through. I yes, mean, they would not... Yeah, I wouldn't draw aggro from them because I'm level 33, so... Uh. And right now, I'm supposed to be near around level 20, but uh, we are over-leveling. Uh. Because uh, we opted to this server, right? This server gives like 50%, no, 100% more XP, so... Yeah, we are over leveled. Otherwise, these guys would be attacking us by now. Huh. Also, only we level up. So. Oh, yeah, that too. Uh, what are we supposed to do here? There's a red circle here. Wait, there's something here. Queer leaflet. What? Oh, okay, that's queer. <laughs> Yep. Mind. Yeah. <laughs> Don't mind me just uh, stealing your documents. Well, I guess these people assumed it was weird like me, so they're like, okay, let it go. They're like good riddance. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whatever, we don't need it anyways. Yep. <laughs> Yo. That's exactly how the talk problem. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. 
Did anything tickle your fancy? Yeah, I have this queer leaflet. <laughs> What the fuck, man? Imagine anyone who opens it and reads becomes queer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> This leaflet. Yeah, yeah, see the wealth of Nal to the hands of your children. It looks like to be some sort of assembly to provide the poor with work. The lettering, though atrocious, is it not? From these <laughs> bits, <laughs> this is sad. <laughs> I mean, my handwriting used to be bad, but no one can. Yeah, that guy drafted a queer leaflet, and this guy call it atrocious. That's it. Yuk. Yeah. Yeah, and these bits about Nal Tal seems somewhat less less than study. I find it hard to believe one among the order penned this. Ha. Huh. Pray they pray take this to the inn at Camp Drybone. Let us see what is stores in make of it. Okay. So this leaflet still stays with us. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's gonna stay with us all the day, but I. Hi, yeah, yeah. La la la. La la la. La 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 la. La la la. La la la. La 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 la. Etienne. Ah. Huh. So what? He's just ditch. Yep, he's ditch. Oh, Saying prayers, like maybe. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I mean. That's what I'm gonna assume. That's it. So she was like chastising her or something, you know. Stop being a crybaby. <laughs> Look at that. Hey, what? What happened? No, no. Read that. Uh, I think it. What? <laughs> <laughs> like who in the right mind named this place Eternal Sleep? <laughs> Like why? Yeah, yeah. What is this supposed to be a bar? Uh, Restaurants? Restaurant and bar? What is Apple? this place? Uh, looks like some sort of medical facility, maybe. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Yeah, this is a medical facility. My savior comes again. To what do I owe the honor this day? Yeah, he is your uh, queer leaflet. What is this? <laughs> Blasphemous! <laughs> uh, I guess she's not progressive enough, huh? Nope. I mean, it's the church, so. <laughs> you <don't> understand. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> These are not our teachings at all. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> well, thank God this Dude, is I not Pride Month. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I bet they did it. Yeah. And thank God this is not Pride Month. Yeah. Yeah, this was not made by. <laughs> This was not made by any true brother or sisters of the order. Of that, I can assure you. I can't. Uh, come to think of it, weeks ago the church was plagued with missing gar garments. Could someone be posing? Could someone be posing as a priest of the order to deceive the people? Okay. 
The plot thickens next. Our culprit pretends to be a priest to lend credence to his deception. There is no doubt an irony in there somewhere. Okay. But I suspect we have a worthy adversary at our hands. I shall consider how best to handle this. For now, tell Isambard what we have learned here. Okay. Why are we telling everyone when we... It's, it's like anyone could be the culprit, right? Yeah. I mean, me. I guess we are learning some shit by sure of telling or showing people or something, yeah. but... Oh well. It's like a cast friendly to I guess. Ah. Posing as a priest to think... These troubling, no these troubling notions aside, it is gratifying to finally be able to move this investigation forward. Thank you once again. Next, I shall keep my eyes and ears open. Now more than ever. Someone yes, got any better stuff? What? I still think this guy is the imposter. Huh. I think these are to go with uh, earlier farms. Yeah. Just take the kill. Should I pick this? Nah, just take this. What are Give these? The, the fuck is that? Yeah, these are dastardly doings. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they are. Easy, Jill. Yep. Uh, if somebody wants to help you identify and apprehend the false priest. Okay. Hmm. I'm afraid I have not seen any unusual activity, nor have any at this camp given me cause to doubt them. But unless we can identify the culprit, and soon more innocents will fall victim. Do not despair just yet, my friend. An idea occurs to me. Okay. Our suspect has been posing as a priest, using leaflets bearing false promises to lure the poor. Let Nix and me serve like. Okay, oh, let no. Nixon me like serve it. like okay. with like by posing as impoverished souls in need of succor. So what? I'm supposed to be a beggar now? Yep. Huh. Uh, I dare hope that this will yield us the answers we seek. We will it will be a dangerous undertaking, but you two are more than capable of looking after yourselves. Hmm. Hmm. Do we even need this guy? He comes up with more stupid propositions. I mean, like his earlier accusation of this shit. I mean, granted, he could still be right, but. Yeah, I mean, at this point. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm next to useless in battle, but I can supply the garments for the disguise. These old tunics and slobs should serve your needs. So, yeah, he has beggar's clothes, then what is he doing with them? <laughs> what is he doing with them? Like, what? Uh... He's a part time beggar or something? <laughs> I guess those are his backup clothes here. I guess this doesn't work out. Huh. I guess it's like he's like the people elect or something and if people decide to like, hmm. you know. So stuff. he got his life figured out then. Yep. You know what he should do if it's everything else fails. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Perfect bandy. Yeah, so long as you don't mind smell and the stains. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, this will serve very well. You have my thanks. Listen, Nix. So as to lay the foundation of our little boy, we must make it widely known that more vagrants have arrived at the camp under desperate for coin. Okay. To this end, I want you to don the old garments that old garments Isambard has lent us and beg for care on the camp. No, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm supposed to be working for a greater cause, like saving the you know entire universe or something. Not this it shit. This. I mean, this fucker is the one who came up with the idea, yeah. Yeah. Before long, yeah. the false priest should catch the wind and approach us. It's not like you got a choice or anything. Yep, I'm supposed to save the universe or something in that capacity. Not doing this shit. Yep. Uh, wait. Okay, I'm supposed to read that. 
Uh, this camera. Okay. It's just useless information about this camp. I mean, if you want, you can read it here. Oh. Uh, I'm supposed to wear the dress. Okay. Uh, okay. Yikes, man. Did the uh, lizard man nest? Okay. Okay, I haven't been looking at the object. What the fuck have you done? What? What? Uh, okay, you were reading this. Yeah, something about lizard man. Ah, now that you know why they are so many more to fame, so cops are both. They are former key. Yeah, the, the one above. Okay. The latter are bound to be given back to the earth. And... Uh, I I meant the dialogue at the start. Okay, you want to read this? Yeah, this is. Uh... Hmm. So I'm a beggar with some fancy boots. Then. <laughs> the fuck. In sweatshirts. I'm just gonna take this away for the added effect. Huh? Okay, can't take this away? I can. See, now I look like proper shit. Yari yari. Look at me, man. What has my life become? Uh, yeah, maybe I'll just beg to him, I guess. <coughs> Give me money, bitch! Oh, that's not how that works. I preach the teachings of Azemia, the warden. Has thou come to partake of the honey of her wisdom? Okay, Azemia is one of the twelve gods. Uh. Azemia is the keeper of sun and goddess of inquiry. All is laid bare beneath the light of her divine countenance. Open thy hearts to this light, needy child, and thou shalt want for naught till the end of days. What the fuck is he on about? I just want money. Yeah, just give me money, man. Not this bullshit. Oh, wait. Why are we bagging again? I forgot. Uh, to make it convincing, I guess? For that priest guy mm. to appear in front of us? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that could be the place, right? For all we know. Yeah, could be. Where's money? Hmm, and you are? Hmm, another refugee by the looks of you. The immortal flames have neither work nor coin for your like. Be gone and see to it that you don't make a nuisance of yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No money, huh? What the fuck I'm supposed to get up there? Uh See, I'm gonna aggressively ask him money now. I'm just gonna run towards him and it's like Money What is it? Gods, not again. So someone came in running like this, huh? It happened to her already. <laughs> Someone just aggressively jumped and asked for money. <laughs> yari, yari. I mean, <laughs> it's bad for her. Yep. Gods, not again. Look, being poor doesn't give you the right to pester whoever so you like. Why don't you keep with your own kind out out by that muddy pond of yours at dry pool? Yari yari. The only thing these people take kindly to beggars. Yep. Okay, I can come through here. Ah, there are stairs here, huh? Yep. I just aggressively jumped on. I mean, on. how do you suppose that lady? Yeah. 
I mean, who knows, man? Maybe she is trying to escape beggars. <laughs> Uh, money, bitch. <laughs> what? Nothing. <laughs> uh, I'm never supposed to get to the good part. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Looking for work, you say? Sorry, but we don't have any openings now. Get out of here so I can finish my story. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Man, begging sucks, huh? Well, garbage. What? What? Is that what it said? That prawns beg for money while uh, go in and come back again. I mean, okay, this guy is motherfucking drunk, huh? Why wants the spots? Damn. I mean, that's not <laughs> what he's trying to. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> oh my god, man. Yeah. Okay, wait, wait. Forgot the objective, man. Never mind. Okay, there's still one guy here. Where? Okay. Uh. Money! Hmm. Greetings, good madam. Is there art I might assist you with? Oh, I don't believe there. I don't believe there is. I'm afraid our ways are very expensive. Mayhaps you should rejoin your fellows at the pawn or the sand cage. <laughs> so she politely said the same thing, huh? Yep. What the fuck? <laughs> It really sucks to be poor. Wait, you didn't dress like this? You fucking bitch! <laughs> You're supposed to be dressed like this too, right? Supposed to be um, begging too. No, I don't think so. Really? Yeah, only we were supposed to do that. That's why I said earlier, it is his idea he's supposed to do it. Because he asked us to do it. You piece of shit, man. Like, he made me go Even into that Amalja's yeah. encampment and bring that queer, flea, uh, you know, queer leaflet. Now he makes me and beg. Yep. Okay. He's like, I'm the idea man, you know. <laughs> Just gonna strangle him to death. Yeah, you yeah, have quite an act for being a nuisance. Uh, no, he says this. <laughs> really? Yeah, I'm this just gonna really kill weird. him. Might as well at this point. The camp is abuzz with the talk of newly arrived vagrants. And though we were unable to attract our wayward transgressor, we were able to learn that the poor have a commune by the pond north of Sandgate <laughs> to the east of here. <laughs> the eyes of the other they do not reach that place, rather the ideal for spiriting away hapless souls. Let us go there and wait for the kindly priest to come and offer us aid and comfort. Needless to say, you will need to remain in disguise. Fuck you, man. Just fuck you. La 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 Yeah now on to our favorite nanny <laughs> I'm debating if I should get a burger. Burger? Borkir Butcher Are you ready? No Okay, thank god man I would have killed him Had he dressed like this At least he is playing the part now 
I still got those fans and boats. Yeah. A fine evening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He is not totally committed to it. Yeah. A fine evening to catch false praise, wouldn't you say? Okay. Yeah. Fine evening, I guess. Sure, I guess. Yeah. Sure. Absolutely. That's fair. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna stab him, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna shank him. <laughs> You look absolutely smashing, Nix. Possibly dressed for the deception. All that's left then is to wait for our quarry to appear. I'm just gonna take that knife off him and shank him, that's it. Oh, you poor unfortunate souls. <laughs> There's no way for men to live. There's no way to me There's no way for men to live. No way at all. Okay. Who are you and what you want? Be at ease, child. I mean, you know how. I'm a priest of the order of Naltar and I come to offer you succor. Okay. This leaflet bears the teaching, uh, teachings of Nal. Trust to them and they will surely set you free from the sh shackles of penury. Hmm. Attempting after, but I'm afraid I must decline. On the account of atrocious performance. <laughs> <laughs> you would have made a god awful, god awful moment. Angust. Angust, that's what this guy is there. <laughs> what? How did you know? <laughs> you bastard tricked me. <laughs> Please don't hurt me. I was only doing it to protect my people. Yeah, clearly. Yeah, sure, buddy. <laughs> Is that so? Do continue. Very well, I'm the man of the Golden Bazaar, raised there, if not born. Some moons ago, Amalja, the Amalja raids began. They would appear to uh, they would appear sudden as as a sandstorm and plunder the village at will. Our defenders couldn't stand against them. Few as they were, everyone lived in fear. I wanted to save my people, but being a merchant was all I know. So, I did the only thing a merchant could do. I approached Amalja in hopes of brokering a deal. In return for sparing the Golden Bazaar, they, may, they made demands outrageous ones. Hmm. Demands? Of what kind? Pray tell. First of all, they wanted to schedule a crystal shipments off from the Nanawa, okay, Nanawa mines. For this, I bribed one of the workers to leak me the information. Next, they wanted me to bring them people, so I posed as a priest to lure in the vulnerable and give them over to Amalcha. I didn't have a choice. Hmm. Protecting, protecting one's home is a noble thing, but at the cost of the innocence? You could have sought the aid of the immortal flames, yet you did not. I suspect you were not telling the full story. What made you sell out your own people? Speak. The... Mm, was good. What was good? What did you say? <coughs> the car was good. I said it. I could sell more meat. I could sell more meat for a score of lifetimes and not even see a fraction of what Amalja pay me. Wait, they have money? Yep. They don't look like people who have money. Well, the more with money. Huh. You sacrifice innocence so that you could line your own pockets. What's felt express the contempt I feel for you. Spare me your contempt. If you want to blame someone for the mess, if you want to blame someone for the mess the world in, blame yourself or the gods. Ah. Ah. <laughs> so there's supposed to be a scream, huh? Yep. Yep. Ah. I didn't know it was still my... yep. Not you again. Were you the one leaking the immortal strength battle routes to the enemies as well? Spit it out. No, I know nothing about that. I swear it. At this stage, I am rather disinclined to believe all that leaves your mouth. But no matter, there will be enough time to learn the truth. Oh no. 
He's sobbing now. Ah, so maybe they do that now. Like, you know, go back for his past or something. See his memories. Do what? Oh, um, look into his past or something. Ah. Yeah, I just realized that we are not in control of that. We can't do it to anyone we need. We won't. Yep. That's I guess just that's the reason why even, yeah, even that lady can't do it to anyone. Yeah. She will so leave that to choice. That's why she needed us more. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, with two of us around, the odds of it happening increases. So. Yep. Yeah. Next, be a dear and take a word of these developments to Minfilia, would you? I shall prize everything I can out of this filth. Hmm. The abductees are still somewhere out here. Our foremost priority is to rescue them. Yay! Yay. Uh, now how to go to baking sands. Wait, I have Esper Bay so tickets. They, they abducted those people to... For what? To transport some crystals or something? Uh, the Amalja, those people ask for crystals. So, they lead, this guy leaked the trade, you know, trading routes of those crystals to Amalja. That's one thing. Okay. And second thing, they ask for, uh, you know, people. And he delivered them. They ask for two things. People for? Uh, we don't know for what. Okay. Uh, yeah, Tataru gave us these tickets. We can use this to teleport to that location. Oh. Well, we got to tank Tataru for that. Okay, why am I still in this close? Maybe we could just embrace the poverty. No, man. <laughs> I mean, first thing, she runs horrible. No. <laughs> and I don't want to add, you know, being poor to that. Next, how, how goes it? All is well here. At least the bookkeeping front anyways. Okay. <laughs> Making so, do, do we have those? Uh, I think he's on or do we have the tiara on? Right now we have that I think is on. If you want Tiara, I can keep Tiara. Yeah. Yeah, no, the Tiara is on. Yep. Much better. <laughs> Much better indeed. Yinthar the Sorar. Scholar. Yeah. Hola, amigo. Welcome back. Next time, please. The Chu and Tiger have been getting along. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, see, you have done well to uncover the truth. My thanks to f my thanks for the report. As Tanker said, we must ascertain where the abductor were taken, and none but the Amalja know the answer. Suffice to say that they will not willingly part with this information. A fear blood will be spilled before all is said and done. So we gotta drink some lizard blood. Huh? I mean, you said blood should be spilled, right? I and mean, blood will be spilled. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we should drink those lizard men's blood. Huh? To instill fear in them. Easy. Huh? <laughs> I have so many questions. Yeah, worry not. <laughs> uh, we like to meet with a, a distinguished individual. Huh, okay. Though we seek a peaceful solution to the primal problem, we, mu we must needs to be ready to fight our own cause. That you might take to feed suitably prepared. I would have you meet with a goblin acquaintance of mine. Goblin acquaintance? Uh -huh. What? I like where this is going. Okay, his name is... <laughs> Muta makes bubbly pots. <laughs> yep. <laughs> what the fuck, man? I'm stunned by that name. Yep. 
Fort makes bubbly farts. And he's a scholar of no small repute. Motomix is a Renu. He's renowned for having introduced a revolutionary method of enhancing equipment in Neosia. The knowledge of this method was since uh, okay, the no the knowledge of this method was once a closely guarded secret, but thanks to Motomix and his students, it's now been disseminated to the great benefit of all the room. It would serve you well to acquire an understanding of the process. For this purpose, I shall lend you a blade. Take it to Mama, Mutamix and bind and bid him to use it to demonstrate his craft to you. Mutamix is ever to be found at his camp at Central Thailand, a place known as Bonfire. Look for a pillar of smoke and the way will become clearer. Okay. Okay, I remember this. Okay, they are just introducing us to a new game mechanic. That's it. That's what that is. It's a new game feature. Oh, she just tried to rhyme the last thing. What? The bonfire and clear. Ah. Yeah, yeah. Sintra the tunnel. Or maybe she didn't. Yeah, we never know. Yep. Chocobo keep. Chocobo. Ah, uh, can I hide it to that place? Nope. Time, Time. Yeah, I think I have to register to that place first, right? Um. I'm gonna run, run, like there's no tomorrow, run, run, wait. Hungry? Huh? What? I'm supposed to, okay. Hungry, hungry, boy. Okay. Look, I can't go through here, so I have to take this direction. Yes, you can. Nothing else impossible. Yeah, yeah. Impossible. Yeah. Slay. 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 Big ass ant. Slay. Cookie booty. My head is cloud still here. Like. Yeah. They are minding their own business. It's just level 5, like I think we can off it with just one word. Yeah, we can just sneeze on them and they'll die. This guy's name is Coco Samu. What the fuck? Mm. Well, Mutamix is here. Okay. Is he is he on something like? Yeah. Oh, he has a mask or something. I guess. Yeah. Oh, that's not what has to get. Yeah, that's his mask, sir. Uh. But still, look at him. Who is the uplander uh, come to tentering of Mutamix bubbly pots? Tentering? Huh. I'm just gonna hand you this knife. Come on. Whitey dual strings in air self. What? I have no clue. When full of ASL, Fighty Tools changes to stony shine. Name of oh, okay. materia. So they're gonna speak in this bullshit language, huh? Yeah. Huh. Wait, what happened? 
and try to increase the BGM. Ah. Uh -huh. Yeah. If not materia, if not materia, join with other fighty tool. Okay. Okay. Then B guys, fighty tool skins, power of air self, air self. Yep, I understood everything. Yep, that's right. The next ones. Psh, psh. What makes this reckoning that Uplander is a friend of Minfilia? Yep. Yes, tongue flaps reach ears of motor mix with fastness. Hmm. <laughs> See, that's the language of gods, man. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong, so. Yep, tongue flaps. I like that. <laughs> Inferia wants Uplander to see the power of materia. Uplander brings fighty tools to Mutamix, yes? Yep, take the. <laughs> fighty tools is unstrong as eating tool. Hmm. Make good. Make good teachy show of power of materia. Uh -huh. The material master. Now, eyes of Uplander point. Okay, now eyes of Uplander point at fighty tools, yes? Psh, psh. Material join with fighty tools. Okay. <laughs> uh, this guy reminds me of that guy. Um, that Misa guy. Jaja Binks. Yeah, 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 that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, fighty tool scans power of materia. Fighty tool reborn. Here, Uplander, take Yay. fighty tool to Minifilia. <laughs> <laughs> materia. Tool, okay, thank God he is speaking normal uh, language. Finally. finally. <laughs> materia, strictly, strictly speaking, speaking is kind of a crystal. It is created by drawing out the etheric constituents from a piece of equipment and then crystallizing them. Not just any old equipment will serve, mind you. It must have sufficient spirit bond. That being a measure of how, how fully an item has been imbued within its own spirit. When ye attach a piece of material to gear, ye imbue the host item with its power. That's how material mutamix turn that dagger of yours from some mat as one would have struggled to cut a stake into a weapon worthy of wielding. Psh! Psh! Uplander wishes to join her of materia. Then Uplander best fill brain case with knowings of crafty making. Hmm. That's one way to put it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. With knowings of crafty making, Uplander can become joiner of materia. If Uplander wants brain case to rattle with knowings of materia, Uplander best trade tongue flaps with lenny ones of mutamix. Hm. Ah. I like this language, man. Yeah. It's just thank you, no? Yep. I'm like, why? <laughs> So I mean we have to approach some knowledgeable ones. I mean we have we have to talk with these guys I guess. I have hard to talk with this guy to unlock it. The thing is No we have to talk he said you have to ask Yeah like, for more information for that memory or something. Yeah we I mean that that lady. Yeah. That hell lady of that Sam's something. Yeah, Minfilia. Yeah, yeah, I mean, the usually long story short, the thing is like uh, once a whore on this care piece of care, not this one. Yeah, this one you can see material slots, right? There are two material slots there. Yeah. Yeah, uh, in that you can uh, add a material. I mean, it's uh, like this. It's a crystal. It will give you extra mm -hmm. stats to the gear. That's it. That's right. what it is. Right. Yeah, so that's what they explained. Yeah, I mean, it's like if you want material or something, 
Uh, let me just unlock this, I guess. That's fine. Huh? We are uh, here, anyways. Uh, so I think there's some said something along the lines of the criteria would be unlocked based on the um, the yielders. Yeah, a gear, or gear, or gear. Like the quality, as the quality of the gear increases, the better quality material you will yield from it. Uh, yeah, what will, uh, what would you say if I told you that inanimate object can possess a soul? They can, believe it or not, although the soul in question is not their own, but that of their owners. Yeah, like, that's what I'm trying to, like, if the more we know about something or something like that, or the more we use it or something, I get it, guess it upgrades or something. Yeah. Along with ones. Yes. Yeah, so they added it as a part of lore, huh? huh? I mean, they made they made up a story for this whole thing, so it's just upgrades for our gear. Yeah, through yeah. fate, through faithful service, the arms and armor that we use come to hold our spiritual energy. Thus, we do form a spirit bond with them. This spiritual energy can be drawn out and converted into materia, a special kind of crystal that can be attached to gear to enhance its properties. I'm well versed with in the ways of materia attraction. If you wish to learn more about the process, it would be my pleasure to teach you. Yeah, sure. You are ready to commence your learning? Good. As you will have gathered by now, materia is a crystallized form of fun spiritual energy. As this energy is derived from an individual psyche, a volatile beast at the best of times, a degree of variance is to be expected in its production. In practice, this means that you won't know exact properties of a stone until you cradle it in your hands. The material won't grant you much of anything on its own. Its power must be tapped, see? And this is achieved by melding it to a gear. No, no though that it takes takes the deft hands of a craftsman to melt material. You can also seek others to attach material on your behalf, but if you would sooner do it yourself. I recommend you speak to Hobos. Melding is her field of expertise. Okay, who? You know that sooner there, that's supposed to be read as far, but that's yeah. one of the aspects of failure. Yeah, I mean, at this point, I don't care, man. No, no, uh, I'm not saying that like, it should literally be right, but it should be interpreted. Yeah, 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 got it. Uh, I can't take this quest. I think you have to level up your crafters to take this quest. Crafting jobs. Okay. So we haven't done them, so... And I mean, we, I guess we stick to the story or something. Yep. I mean, it's kind of pointless, no? Yep. I mean, material is not that useful until you reach the end game, so. Uh, eh. Screw material. Yeah, screw the bab up. up. <laughs> Reminds me of that uh, PS Voice Line Phantom Assassin Simon material. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how to go to Vespers. Pay. Get it because we don't have material. Yari yari. Yeah, yeah, you get it right, like, you know. Yep. A material. Not have. Yeah, just yeah. don't. You, you, you get it. Just don't! <laughs> Nedric Iron Heart. Hmm. So this guy has Iron Hearts, man. Huh? I mean, it's a blue quest, so I'm just gonna take this, I guess. Hello, Hala Tali. Okay. And the take of the answer has some useful information you wish to share. Hi. Hail adventurer, I'm Nedric and Hart, an explorer by trade and a scion by allegiance. And you, my friend, look to me as an adventurer in need of a challenge. Happen to know just a place that will offer it to you. Tucked away in the corner of Eastern Dana lies Halatali. It is 
and it is there that you will find all the excitement you crave. The place bears a storied history. This build uh, and this build some hundreds of years have passed as a training grounds for gladiators. Oh no, I skipped. Motherfucker, I skipped the whole day long. What you do? Yari yari. <laughs> yeah, the calamity laid ruins to it though. Yeah, the and I, yeah, and he did two most things. No, Haltali is a shadow of his former self, but in the dark of that shadow lurks for a wild beast. Both brothers, Tian beyond gone. Was one such as yourself, I dare say. There is no place finer than Haltali to test your skills and refine your technique. Indeed, I have taken the liberty of passing your name along. To the flames who oversee the place. You do visit freak with one of the yeah fafa near the entrance way. Yeah, it's a dungeon. Fafa journey, huh? Yep. Uh, it has a tantalizing bit of information to share with an adventurer. Hey, adventurer, you wear expression of one who seeks new battlegrounds to hone your burgeoning skills. Do not ask how Nedrick knows. He simply knows. Okay. Now tell me, how do you pass chance familiar with Sunken Temple of Khan? I will not hold it against you if you are not. These ruins only surface when the calamities split the ground asunder. After all, any road, it's a popular destination. These are for adventure looking for new country to explore. And if you are keen to join them, why not make journey to Southern Thailand and visit the temple for yourself? What's with the danger that lurks within? The mortal flames are keeping close watch to the place by the Lal of Hell by the name of Bibi Mu. Should offer you passage. Yeah, I'll just unlock to a few dungeons, I guess. Hmm. What the fuck is she doing there? Elaine wants to be alone, huh? Yep. She's just looking for some Elaine time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was right. <laughs> I swear, man, they chose these names on purpose, you know. <laughs> yeah. Can't make that shit up. Hey yo! Welcome back. Next, I trust your visit to Bonfire Pro Pro Fruitful. Yep. Yeah, I exchange some tongue flaps with that. Weird guy. <laughs> <laughs> ah, what a remarkable difference a, a single piece of material can make. Granted, the skills the skills needed to manipulate the substance are not easily acquired, but one need only to look upon the results to realize such efforts are worth, such efforts are worthwhile. As I'm sure you are aware, the quality of one's equipment can be the difference between victory and defeat. Materia may well give you the edge you need next, so make it your ally. Now it's time to discuss the matter of your next mission. Pray speak with me once you are ready to begin. Yes, sure. My body is ready. Uh, I'll just, do we just stop it here? Let's do it. Yeah, we can stop it here, but... Yeah, uh, next time we do it, uh, let's start with the uh, uh, huge list quest. Yeah, um, I have a, we have a job quest to do, right? It will unlock new abilities, so. Um, sure. Um, yeah. yeah, we're not in the middle of anything yet, right? Of, um, right now, we are not. I mean, now we have yeah, to yeah. go on investigate that place, I guess. What place again? Wait, no, Seven, not investigate. Really Amalja. Uh, okay, we still don't have to. Yeah, they are being at. Uh, we don't know where they are. They, you know, yeah, they abducted yeah, yeah. people, so we have to investigate that. Yeah, also, they took away some crystals or something, I guess. Not crystals. They stole something, right? Materia? No, oh, wait, no, no. yeah. Yeah, they stole some crystals from a mine, too. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, we have that to deal gotcha. with, so. Easy. Yep. Easy. So, yeah, so we stop here, eh? Yeah. Is it the yeah. case? Yeah. Stop yeah. was three 